Hey guys, Skitsy here. Welcome back to our Lady Zurong campaign where we are still trying to unite the tribes. We have one left, Shamok, right here in the middle. Um, however, we have two coalitions to worry about. Well, not necessarily full coalitions yet, but Liu Bei has declared war on us. And I just noticed he has two territories up here. And this guy right here is uh, one of Yuan, Shao, Yuan, Yuan Shao's vassals. I was originally gonna take these two armies over here and just smash our way east to try and, uh, you know, eliminate Shamok to uh, fulfill this campaign requirement here. But I think I'm gonna I'm gonna detour. I'm gonna take these two uh, and just swing them over here to the east and north to take over all of all of this um, with the idea of hopefully that'll be enough to get Leo Bay to go to peace with us because he's actually in a coalition with Cao Cao. So I would hate for this war to drag on and him, uh, you know, essentially ask Cao Cao to, uh, to go to war with us too. And then we're, we're essentially at war with the biggest three factions in the game. Um, not quite prepared for that. And bonus, hopefully I can trade these to our coalition buddy over here, Wu Tugu for maybe uh, some of these so I can con consolidate, you know, some of my area down here or even this one. Um, just so I don't have like all of his territory just kind of spread out through ours. And then finally we have this this uh, faction down here who is also a vassal, vassal of Yuan Chao. Uh, however, we're not quite at war with them yet. They are very unhappy with us. So I think we are going to take Queen Zurong's army. Just kind of have her hang out like around this area so she can react to whatever and then we will have I forget this guy's name du Duosai? Duosai? I don't know we're gonna take him and hopefully slowly chip off Shamok's stuff we'll probably get stopped around here uh, if the if the army stacks up there we, we won't we probably won't be able to take it with just that army um, but we'll see so that's kind of the plan of attack so let's uh, you know get to it I wonder if it makes sense to put her in the water or not. We could just have her cross right here. All right, she can move there. Does is anyone? Okay, so we are still replenishing, so no force march there. Yeah, see, we were gonna swing him down that way. Um, yeah, we're just gonna double stack both these armies. Destiny awaits. Still a bit of replenishment that needs to happen. Uh, there's a bridge right there. So yeah, we'll just have to swing down, scoot around that way. Uh, you know, I wouldn't be sad too if Liu Bei actually had something over here to take over some of these uh, from our vassal so we could just straight take them back, um, use that as more leverage. But uh, you know, we'll see what happens. All right, that, that, and last one here. Yeah, he's only gonna make it to this village. Uh, still a time, oh, she's pretty hurt. So probably two more turns of replenishment. We'll be able to see what, what's in this village um, next turn. Hopefully no one's there, we can just take it over. That'd be nice. Where is the edge? I think. Yeah, I think that's it. So these four. Yeah. All right, that's non-man lands. That is not. That is not. All right, so it's really we, I mean, we just, whoops. We that is not what I wanted to hit. Stop it. Yes, so uh, we'll definitely want this. That's the main one there. I, I don't know, you know. I don't know if uh, if the entire like commandery or whatever it's called county thing counts as non-man just because the capital is, or if these just don't matter because they're not like labeled. I guess I could look at other ones. Yeah, these are individually labeled, so I guess it's only specifically that one. And I think that's the only one left that we we need to worry about. Um, I know I've I've said in previous games oh that's not even a city i'm trying to look at <laughs> um there's no there's no way to like quick filter to see what you know what counts as a non-man land so you just kind of have to hover over 
So we got two here that are con three that are controlled by our vassal or coalition member, whatever. I still consider him a vassal. Uh, but I think it counts as ownership for us because we're, we're allies or whatever. Anyways, enough rambling. I do actually want to continue to develop this one because this, this one's a pretty good one to develop. Uh, we have this foreign building that we normally wouldn't get that gives us 150 income from commerce and plus 50% trade influence, which is pretty good. There's not a, a, a super crazy amount of commerce here, but we do have this, uh, you know, a chain, uh, a building line here, and then this one that we can keep going to uh, to kind of keep pumping into that commerce and just getting more money. So I am actually going to upgrade this one and then get rid of uh, the uh, the corruption with that one. You know, because for a long time I I was not really doing anything with the with the buildings, um, and I'm probably still not going to do anything else besides that one. Yeah, I'm not even going to mess with that. Uh, let's take a look at some quick deal. Who wants a piece? Shamo, yes. No thanks, though. So we got a maybe and maybe. And, you know, we could we could just go in here and do they this. But look how much it would cost us. Literally all our money, and then we're paying them for a bunch of money for 10 turns. So, like, 70,000 gold total, plus all our food and, you know, a toy. That is absolutely ridiculous. I can't afford that, and I, I would... Sh I would not accept that deal just on principle. So anyways, let's end the turn. Uh, he got his buddy to join the war against us. That's not great. All right, so there was some movement up here. Yeah, we got two armies coming out of the shadow. Um, huh, both Leo Bay at war with her. Are we at war with this? Thing? Oh, thir a third army from Leo Bay. I mean, like, that's fine that the legendary AI just wants to, you know, crowd around our stuff, even though I'm pretty sure Leo Bay is at war with Shemok as well. Not you again. Yeah. Like, he could have probably very easily just <laughs> completely rolled over Shemok here. But uh, all his armies are up here against us. I mean, you know, totally, totally plausible. I mean, that's what I would do if I was the... Uh, the AI, yeah, totally. Uh, so I think we have to change where we're at, or uh, the direction, I guess. Could maybe do like a sneaky little ambush over here with one of them. I don't know how far we can get. Seventy-five percent chance anywhere. I always forget what the uh, ambush requirement is. The twenty-five, yeah, it's much lower than. Uh, Warhammer 2, I think. Warhammer 2, I think you need um, 50%. Um, why isn't that letting me do it? I don't know. Whatever. Uh, we're just going to move move these guys up so they're close enough. Um, slide him back. I just I just screwed up the uh, the ambush um, movement range. I you know I don't know. It says campaign movement range required to adopt 25%. He had 28%. I'm not sure why it wasn't letting me put him in ambush mode. Um, but whatever. All right, so they'll kind of go up there. Maybe these guys will attack here. Doesn't look like they can reach my guys. Uh, he's. Um, I don't know which way he's gonna go. Either way, I'm gonna try and catch one of these guys, uh, uh, you know, uh, off guard. Uh, that's probably not the right word, but out of out of position or something like that. All right, is everyone fully? Everyone's fully healed, right? Yeah. All right, let's uh, let's move. All right, let's creep up a tiny bit. And see if we can. Oops. Do not break. Are we empty? Yep. All right, let's take it over. Can't reach. Um, we'll take it next turn. Low satisfaction. Low satisfaction. Can I just get rid of you? It's down to eight. You know, I really wish there was a way to dismiss him from this screen. Uh, 
what's this guy's name? G. All right, let's go up here. Let's find him. There he is. Ah. Goodbye. Oh, where's the other one? It's legendary. Up to 19. Hmm, maybe, uh... Oh, she's like, uh, uh, an, uh ma you know, mainland Chinese. I'm actually gonna get rid of her. I don't care how important you are. Actually, wait, is she... Okay, yeah, she's just at court. You're like ruining our satisfaction. All right, gotta keep it high. And I apologize for continuing, continuing, continuing to hit the escape key there. It's like a, uh, uh, it's like a, I always default hit escape to try and get out of menus even if it doesn't work. All right, where, uh, I think this is, yeah, this is the one. Oh, we, we got four turns and two turns before we're doing anything else here. Um, yeah, anyways, all right, let's end the turn. All right, so we brought his other vassal in against Shamok. Okay, nothing else concerning there, that's fine. All right, so they moved weird. They moved very weird. You put him right up against the river, but can't actually reach him. And these two were coming down here on um, the city, which I can't actually reach. Hmm. Well, I guess we just move down to defend the city. I mean, we can get in range of the city. So we'll get we'll get pulled in. We can just force march him down. So we go like that. Alright, we can we just put him right in there. That's fine. That they'll be uh, they'll be fatigued or whatever, but it theoretically should not attack this city. Are you in range? Yeah, he should be in range, okay. Another, oh, there's another, wow, all of Leo Bay's stuff. Right here. Oh, something else going on up there. Don, Don Min, look at that portrait. I like, Let us get oh, this that's simple. not, you're not. This portrait's pretty cool. I like that guy. Cool, man. All right, so, slightly concerned about this. If they kind of wait to triple stack, might be might be kind of a fight quadruple stack I'm really not confident um, however they initiate the fight where it's like 2v2 um, yeah, no no big deal follow me towards victory all right so what are you doing why are you creeping up in our in our territory man I don't like Strong it put her there He's gonna go ahead and take this over. Boom. The people's voice cannot be silenced. Economic breakthrough. Too bad I can't research anything. You grant me a kindness in calling, my lord. Alright. So he's gonna keep moving up. I can't imagine Shamo can afford anything other than just a single stack army. So we'll take him creep up this way. Maybe we can uh, get his capital relatively easy. If it's defended, we can always swing out and get those two. Uh, this this will be a mess. All right. Well, and it, it like it like super lags to get into the screen. I'm not sure why. We only have 27 generals. Uh, diplomacy. Let's keep our eye on this. Yes. Uh, well, can't see the score. Minus 29, and then minus 13. Let's see what this. Let's see what this I takes. No with this is ridiculous. 13 points. 
13 points. And we have to be as... <laughs> Get out of here. I, I, this is like tedious. Uh, 30, 35,000 something. That's like all our all our stockpiled gold. I mean, I guess the argument of uh, paying him monthly pay or seasonal payments makes more sense because if they attack us again, then you know it breaks that. Um. All right. Well, I, I guess that's fine. We still got another turn before that. Uh, we want to upgrade that city, so let's go ahead and end the turn. Tao Tao declared war on someone. It went to peace. Okay. Well, I think we can take the fight to these two. He's just out of range. So we do the, f uh, if they retreat, then we're kind of just like stuck out in the open, right? I mean, I, I think we, we have to try and do it either way. I don't, I don't think we really have a, have a choice. <clears throat> Can you retreat if you're encamped? I don't, you know, I, I don't know. I don't know the answer to that. All right, let's move some of this stuff tried. first. Dude, what? Wait a second. Oh, stupid Wutugu lost the uh, settlement down there. That's why he went over there. Well, either way, she's going to come watch. hang out Let's here. He's going to move up. Uh, this way. Marching. Probably won't have... Uh, yeah, we won't see it for another two turns. See who's there. We'll definitely take that. I'm going to be super angry if he, like, takes that one and just keeps going this way or something. Um, instead of, you know, consolidate, consolidating all this stuff around his territory. All right, let's see about this fight then. All right, where's the edge here? All right, here we go. Stoke passions and strike. Large army, Pyrrhic victory. Dang, we got the three, three bad boys here. Some horse archers, those will be annoying. And we're we're attacking too, so they're gonna you know. Is it an encampment? Yeah, it's an encampment battle. So half his army is gonna come in from the side. Alright, well I mean we just gotta try and do it, I guess. So here we go. Oh, uh, his army's gonna show up right behind us. So I guess we position to take care of that, right? That would, uh, make the most sense to me. Oh, certainly would. Alright, so one, two, three. Let's get you guys on the side. We'll put you in a, be in a better place in a second. Ah! Ah! Alright, um, these axe throwers, yeah, so, I wonder what the best way to 
set this up. Kind of feel like doing this. Oh, the range is so short, it's so annoying. To just shoot in the flank there. <clears throat> Those are all the spears. Those guys are pretty strong. And we can do axe throwers on the sides. And all these guys can come in and smash that way. Uh, so I guess um, we'll probably want to run those guys right over here because I imagine if I'm killing this army, this army might come out of the encampment to try and fight us. So that's what I think will happen. Warriors, get ready. Ah, get out of here. I, oh, it canceled my thing. Oh, that's super annoying. You guys slide up. I was too far over. That's annoying. Yeah, we're not doing any of that. Those guys are getting clobbered by uh, um, cavalry. Yeah, those guys just got completely run over. You are still going to die. Stand ready. Open fire. Attend Some of these guys are not getting Double over there like they're supposed the to be. Run. Craven dogs. The battle to attention. At the ready. Your armor cannot protect you. Trying to get Leo Bay down. That would be pretty ideal. Get up there. Another enemy of China falls. I think we got him. Right, that's pretty good. Get up over here. Stand ready. All right, so they're chilling in there. That's fine. The South will bow to the hand. Where is the spirit I was told about? Fire upon them! Attend! All right, get the spirit. Oh, his little faceplate keeps moving. Steal yourselves. All right, that's good. Uh, where are you guys going? Come back this way. That's gone. Just pile on him. Yeah, I think we'll be okay. I mean, there's a lot of stuff happening right here. That's not super great, but uh. He's almost down. Whoops, no, 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 no. It's not exactly what I wanted to happen. Okay, you guys are stuck. Get out of there. Some of these guys are just getting kind of hammered. Trying to get the spears on this guy. Stuck. Ready, warriors. Destroy them. Face my blade. No, no, 
that won't do. Be quiet now. All right, get back down here. Smash, smash that way. All right, he's running away. I think all you guys can just kind of line up right there now. The enemy warriors are running. Tribesmen. I really want to get him down. What are you at? Uh, three, three point seven k. Uh, you guys were supposed to be stopping. Stop right there. Okay, they're all dead. We'll come back over here. All right, we'll get reorganized. You guys even gonna be a, gonna, gonna be able to take him down? Down to 500 something. 63. The enemy general right. has fallen. Boom. Okay, let's reorganize here. Let's see. Actually, gonna take all these guys and put them in the same group. These guys will be in the same group. Alright, let's see. Four. We need all our ranged units together. Four. Close enough. up real bad. Alright, six. I think I can kind of like put these guys over here to do a, a flank stuff. I'm gonna make them walk though so we can... They'll be over there by the time we're like positioned on this side. The two of our generals are pretty busted here. Alright, now who's left? One, two, three. You guys can just kind of go all the way to the other side. As uh, ideally, we'll want to flank in at the same time. I don't have any fire arrows anywhere, I don't think. Mercenary archers. Yeah, my my other army, we have the, the non-man fire arrow guys, and I can just burn down all the walls and stuff, which is ideal, but uh, yeah, we don't have that. Could, however, run our archers up here in these woods, even though they'll get shot a whole bunch by, you know, their archers and stuff. We can really just take out G Militia here and, um, you know, kind of make it a little opening right here. So I'll go ahead and push them up. Even if I lose quite a few of them, that's fine. Probably flank with the elephants. Uh, I think I need you guys to start running now. I'm just gonna give the the full on attack order, and I'll adjust them as needed. All right, they can already reach. Yeah, they're you're gonna get pummeled here a little bit. Ooh, yeah, the slingers are not. <laughs> oh, whoa, whoa. What are you guys running for? Alright, we'll just go ahead and flank with all them. Uh, maybe fall back. You guys are getting pounded here. Oh yeah, that hurts. 
Yeah, they just completely pulled their guys back. Baited me into that. Ooh, look at them getting getting destroyed here. Yeah, you guys are dumb. Guys are getting shot. Okay, fine. Let's go ahead and move them up. And keep you guys going that way. And even though those guys are spears, I'm just going to plow right into them with the elephants. All right. Pile in on them. Are you going to let me just engage you in a fight? Not great. Look, the enemy run. Oh, oh God. Okay. Oh, God. What did I do? Shoot them. Trying to regroup here. Spread these guys out. Oop, got some guys doing nothing. Okay, took that over. Chase here. Who's on fire? Someone's on fire. Uh, I don't like that. Why don't you come attack here? Uh, my guys are getting beat up here. Did I lose elephants? Yeah, one one ran away. You take over the main point. That's fine. Attack here. Going in like phalanx mode. What is going on over here? Look, the enemy Bunch of dead run. people. Alright, that's good. That's fine. Still getting shot over here. Probably lost way more people than I should have, but you know what? These things happen. Huh. Well, kind of losing over here now. No, no. Come back. I'm not, not concerned about him. I wanna I want you to stop losing people over here. Alright, everyone's gonna run. I think we're good. Boom. Is it better than a Pyrrhic victory? I sure hope so. Eh, whatever. 324 kills with that guy. Elephants are crazy. All right, let's see if we captured anyone. Follow your desires, and victory will come. Ooh, could uh, com just like completely get rid of him. I don't know. I don't know who you are, though. I don't know if it's worth killing this person. Oh, we could just take them. We have Scarred, Authority. Uh, yeah, let's you steal her. This guy, though. 
Um, spare my life. Do to do. If I kill him, then the chances of actually getting to like go to peace with him are pretty low because you know atrocities, blah blah blah. Killed friend. Man. I mean, whatever. He's only a sentinel, level seven. Not sentinel. Is it sentinel? I forget the class. Uh, strategist. I guess I am actually gonna release him. Free the prisoners. Only three percent. Hey, look, one three three seven. Ha. <laughs> um. Yeah, didn't capture any of them. Oh, they are wounded though. We could kill them. Even though three percent is like nothing, I feel like. Armies are beat up enough that we have to do this. You serve a greater cause now. Cause what, we got like two more armies staring down at us? Peace through conquest. Oh man, we could reach them, but then that's a full army. Oh no, no, we would not be able to Only survive that. Part. All right, he just needs to move back. On the mark. 45% chance for an ambush. Are you within... He is within there. Within the range, I mean. So if he attacks us, we'll have to fight all of us. I guess I could just... Hmm. I do need to move him slightly back, though. All right, he's in with the range of that. We'll do ambush. I mean, even an ambush won't really be great. Honestly, I'd just auto-delegate it because it would, you know, the population of, or the, the unit strength of all these together is kind of better to auto-delegate than to try and manually do a broken army in an ambush and wait for reinforcements. Oh, is, there, is that like a sixth army up there? Fifth army? Okay, so it is it is just five. It was five, like I saw. Oh man. Um we're kinda in trouble over here, I think. If they don't attack us, we'll be pretty close to full strength next turn. Let's see what that did to our diplomacy. Minus 18. Kindness is a strength. This is ridiculous. That only gives you 1.4 to become their vassal. That should literally like take care of all of it. That is the most ridiculous trade thing I've ever seen. Oh, they'll guarantee our uh, uh, autonomy. How nice of them. That counts for 10.4, but actually becoming someone's vassal is 1.4. Get out of here. That was ridiculous. Ridiculous diplomacy. I think that's it, right? Um, I forget the name of the new one. Okay, so that one's upgraded and now we're locked behind the tree. I don't care about peasantry right now. I don't care about that either. All right, let's bring our camera back up here and hit the intern button. Whoa. Uh. Whoa, no, no, no. What the crap? Okay. <laughs> uh. Yeah, I mean, we. Hmm. It says Pyrrhic victory again, but our, our, our strength is almost like half, you know, filled up there. Do we just delegate this? But I mean, I'm, I'm scared our army is just going to be completely ruined for that next full army stack over there. If we withdraw, maybe that gives them a chance to, uh, to bring up the other ones. I mean, I, I guess the correct way to do this is to manually do it Go hide on a hill, consolidate all the forces, make them come to us, and uh, try and conserve. 
casualties the best we can. But I mean, these are the most, like, some of the two most OP guys um, in the game. So it's like bringing them down. All right, well, whatever. That's pretty much what I have to do. All right, so we just moved all our guys all the way in the back here, and we're just gonna hit start battle and move move backwards and just like consolidate. At last, our reinforcements are. I mean, they're gonna they're gonna run straight right towards us, basically. And try and utilize some of this water to. Uh, Force them into bad positions, I guess. I don't know. Get over here. All right. So what do we got? Um, don't we have more coming? I thought we had more coming. Put our elephants together. Literally just gonna put all those guys together. Alright. Um, Alright, we should be seeing them at some point. There they are. Wait, do I have to attack them? I thought they were attacking me because... Oh, I guess if it's an ambush. Oh, man. Did I just completely screw all that up? Ah, whatever. And we gotta cross water again. <laughs> Alright, well, I'll cut out a huge chunk of this of just walking up there. It's silly. It's my bad. All right, we're getting pretty close here. They keep inching backwards. Just get everyone across the river. Why are you so lagging behind? Do have big shields, I guess. Slightly move these guys over. I want to try and get nice, nice big flanks on them, surround them here. All right, why don't you guys go ahead and hurry up? Some of these guys are majorly hurt. Oops. Bring up the elephants! Take heed, warriors! Run! guys just keep inching back it's getting kind of annoying really hope there's no one just chilling in here because that'd be kind of disappointing one step closer to victory oh okay we're starting to hit them cool with that Archer militia versus mercenaries. We're definitely gonna win. Of course, those sword sword guards are gonna just destroy my guys. Right, where where are their leaders? Watch out! The enemy lies in wait for us. Oh, there they are. No, no, no. Okay, come back. Should have turned all those off to begin with. 
Ah, uh, my guy just got clobbered. Okay. Stop. All right, we should be able to overwhelm them with archers and stuff there. Those guys are going to get killed eventually, but uh, that's okay. Oh, what are you doing? Get up there. All right, let's try and move through and just get rid of their archers. with that. Actually, why don't all you guys try and go out there? Okay, there we go. Oh, that's not good. I do not want him fighting him. Why don't you run on back down here? Guys are getting beat up. Steal yourselves. Your armor cannot protect you. Did he kill he killed all my guys there? Uh that's not great. Okay, where are you guys going? I'm over here, I guess. Yeah, he's killing all my guys. That was, yeah, see, that's, like, not, not what I should have done. Oh, there we go. Well, it only took killing two of them, right? <laughs> all right, get on him there, you guys. Just pile on him. I think that's the last guy. Leo Bay is gone somewhere, right? Oh, he's right here. Get him, guys. Oh my god. Uh Guan Yu, silly man. Is he gonna fight to the very end? Cause that'd be super sad. Just gonna like destroy my guys. No. Fight, you fool! Stop talking. All right, so he should be down soon. Oh, jeez. See if we can get, do anything to his morale. His morale is not hurt at all. Fantastic. These guys are just going to decimate my army. So I definitely don't want to pit them against uh, any of my generals any more than I already did. Okay, Leo Bay is down. Alright, literally everyone kill this guy. Except for you. No, maybe you too. Is he gonna kill he's gonna kill this guy. <laughs> oh my god. So ridiculous. So much for conserving army strength. Alright. God, that was bad. I saw it coming too. I'm like, do I wanna do anything about that? Decisive victory? Sure. Much better than the Pyrrhic victory it wanted to, uh, or it told us we were going to get. 204, 116. I defeated all of them and they came full strength too the next turn. Ridiculous.
Leo Bay. I think we gotta execute him. Execute them both, right? I mean, the, that means like the chance of peace is gonna be pretty much nothing. We get his stuff. Well, that was interesting. We'll take 2% replenishment, even though it's nothing. Uh. Oh boy, <laughs> this is gonna be, this is gonna be really bad. Retreat is our only option here. Retreat. Oh boy, did we survive a turn? Oh no. It looks like our, our army retreated to the east. There's no way we're winning this one. It's fine. Bye bye army. Okay, look at all look at all those notifications. Jeez. All right, so peace. Battle surgeon, cool. Uh, successor, because I killed. What's his face? Okay, doesn't affect us. Prisoner released. Who? What faction is that? Uh. Huh. Look at all this relationship lost, rival. <laughs> Crazy. Foreign trespasser, okay. All right, I'm gonna ignore all that stuff for a second. Yeah, look at all that. Wounded. Huh, well, we could totally kill him. Is he on this side of the river? I can't tell. Mission can never be stopped. If he's on that side of the river, then we can't we can't get him. And it kind of shows that we would be able to reach him, so we'll have to figure that out. So we lost in an, an entire army. Uh, we killed <laughs> we killed Leo Bay. You know, I, I don't think I've ever done that before. Oh, and it, we just made things worse. Um, personal rivalries minus 50 execute our generals war atrocity atrocities yeah very unfriendly so the the thought of ever going to peace with Leo Bay's faction is looking pretty non-existent and what 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 is his name even like I don't even know did he not have any like kids are you still in a yeah still in a faction with um Cao Cao and they have the Duchy of Wu as a uh, as a vassal. Huh. Well, that's fun and terrifying and scary. How much more? we have almost 60k, so we could we could just run and recruit over here or something and just start over. Like they can just take this over, uh, you know. Um, we could step up here and try and see if we can snipe that guy out, but more than likely, I can't really tell how far he can go. Because this army is like in the way. Uh, they're gonna lose that. Not sure what he's doing. Uh, not much going on on this side. Where are you? That's you, Wu. Okay. Well, we have to assume that as we continue to fight, we're gonna end up going to war with pretty much everyone. So. You know, we, we probably should max out how many armies we can have. Um, so, yeah, anyways, eventful episode. I think I'm going to end it here. So thanks so much for watching. Thanks for stopping by. I appreciate it. I'll see you next time.